Welcome to Electron Online, and now we're going to take a look at some practical applications of osmotic pressure and the principles of osmos osmosis. And in this case, what we're going to do here is see, well, why would we want to try to reverse the osmosis? In other words, if we apply a pressure on the side where the solution is more concentrated than on the other side where the solution is less concentrated or we have a pure solvent, by, refer, by applying sufficient pressure, at least as great or greater than the osmotic pressure, you will actually reverse this process. So what will happen then is instead of having more molecules, more of the solvent moving from the less concentrated side to the more concentrated side, you can actually reverse that process and have a situation where more of the solvent molecules will travel from the high concentration to the lower concentration and less molecules will travel from the lower concentration to the higher concentration and slowly begin to push the solvent molecules that are on this side into the other side producing a clear or a, a what we call a pure solvent. So why would we want to do that? Well there are cases where for example we want to produce drinking water from salt water. So what we can do is we can put ocean water right there, apply a great amount of pressure, push the push so hard that we overcome the osmotic pressure of seawater and we actually can push uh, clear water or, or pure water through the semipermeable membrane to the other side and then collect on the other side and then have drinking water. As a matter of fact, there are some places in the world, especially in the Middle East and also like in Florida, where we actually take seawater and produce drinking water through this process. So in the next videos, we'll try to figure out how we can actually apply osmotic pressure for something like that, for producing drinking water out of seawater, and also for doing other things in industry, perhaps produce power and things like that. So this osmosis here has some potential for doing quite a, things for, quite a few things for us, and so let's go and explore those one at a time.